Hey, it's Scott Chef's Dummies. I'm Scott. Bart. We got an Elijah Craig barrel proof, but it's not the usual 12 year. Mm -hmm. It says eight and private. Store pick. Yeah. Eight years old. We're going to test it. Bottle of Baby Wow style. What's it going to be like? No expectations. So, we've been all over the Elijah Craig, but tell me about this one because you found it. We, like most people, we love Elijah Craig barrel proof. Right. There's some variations we batch like to it batch. A, a little more than most, maybe. Mm, I don't know. I do. Consensus is <laughs> generally out on that one. Okay. <laughs> we don't know everybody else. Just so, this is a store pick. This is Auburn Spirits, our store here in Wichita. They got a, a private barrel, mm. uh, which Elijah Craig is doing now. This is and this is the second one in Wichita that I know about. Wow! So now they unlike, tasted they tasted a bunch of samples and picked one, or they just had a shot. I would imagine, like most barrel picks, they mm -hmm. get three or four samples right. sent so to I'm them, thinking, and then they and go then this they one, choose one, right? And this one's sixty four point two five percent. That's good. So the regular triannual release is 12 years old, and it tells you on the label on the side. Yeah, I like when you say tri, 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 tri annual. Tri tri no. annual. Is that I right? I think you're right. I don't know if I get it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. tri Quarter, annual. Uh, no, triannual. Not quarterly quarterly would be four. Like four. Tri you got it. Triannual. Or would that be every three years? A triannual. Well, well, in the comments, go down there. Uh, put it in. <laughs> so. Uh, all these store picks, as far as I know, are coming in, I think, eight years old, maybe nine. Um, but it does tell you on the label, at least on this eight. one, eight years old. What I'm looking for on this, I'll tell you. So, all right. I love Elijah Craig. I'm a huge, huge... It's my favorite bourbon is the Barrel Proof. All right? 12 years Barrel Proof. I'm curious to see, knowing that this is eight... Where's it land? It is the high proof. Digging that. Before you pour me light. Oh, I'm sorry. Not that I need too much, but a little bit more. All right. You can have whatever I, I expect the bottle of Wow ABV punch. Yeah. Not as much depth as the 12 year. Okay. You know Let's what, see. though? I'm going to want to go head to head, maybe with the last mm. C we did. Mm. Just throwing it out, just tossing it. Because what I find out with these, when I've done some Elijah Craig's head-to-head, -head, you that's when I'll pick up the differences. Otherwise, they're they're the same enough that I can't quite distinguish it by itself. It's only within the family. Ooh, we could do an Elijah Craig family shootout. That'd be high proof drunkenness. Sorry, got excited. Um, there's a little bit more depth here than I was expecting. Nice Elijah Craig bourbon palette here cinnamon oak brown sugar yeah all of it a little lighter about what I expected compared to one of the 12 year releases now the only thing I could say and maybe that's what you mean by lighter is usually I'll get this beautiful velvety touch on the cheek from the, the Elijah Craig bottle of wow the barrel proof and I've noticed that on their regular small batch, I don't get that. Now, that's much lower proof, but I, mm, I get a nice caramel popcorn in the finish there. That's the Elijah Craig I know. I didn't get the velvety mouth feel as much, which I thought I would just because of the proof. That's interesting. So maybe it's not the proof. Maybe it's the age that gives the velvety mouth feel. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, it's got, I mean, it's got a nice coating. Um, do you pick I, up something on the forefront right off the bat I get a little cola that I don't think I usually get with Elijah Craig at all even small batch I got a little cola nut cherries sometimes but maybe I'm not maybe even cherry no, cola even I no, might I say that I think I'm getting maybe a hint of flat cola mm, right right at the first flash Pre-swallow, first flash in the mouth, and I'm getting a cola nut 
kind of flavor that I don't normally get from Elijah Craig. Hmm. That's interesting. Because mm -hmm. usually, what I like about the Elijah Craig Barrel Proof is, other than the proof changing things, I don't, that's why I'm saying, I don't really pick up a lot of flavor differences. But we have done some other store picks in the past. I'll take another heavy one. And, um, as I did too. Two, two, yeah. two good sized drops. Yeah, seemed light. It didn't seem like a lot hit the water there. Oh. Maybe your siphon was He's off. <laughs> um, I'm not getting too much here outside normal Elijah Craig barrel proof. Just, I don't mean thinner. It's just a little, it's not as rich, it's not as saturating as the 12 year, which okay. would be, uh, which I expected. Can I grab that one right there? I will. Yeah. Oh, all right. I did move studio, so I'm still getting set up. I don't have everything in here. Here's your, oh, you got a Glenn Karen. Mm-hmm. You anticipated. That's the last match. That's C9-21. I did anticipate. We can share this one, Glenn Karen. It's called Triad. We can share the triad. Almost a little nuttiness, maybe. Mm. You think a little Yeah, onion. that's what I'm saying. Cola nut. Cola nut. 60.18. So this will be a little bit. That's Look pretty at the close. Color, though, oh, I yeah. mean, I know this one's. Because this is, again, 64. So this. So your little eight year here is going to be more proof. Hmm. Well, and the ABV goes down as they age. Yeah. So, oh. Look at that. Yeah, the color is darker with that 12. All right. Yeah, see? Look at that. It was a wow. His version is a whoo. I have a wow. <laughs> and a cough. It took his breath. This is what I'm telling you. Yeah, there's a lot more punch to this. But it's even a lighter proof, though. That's the whole deal. Yeah. It's a lighter ABV by four. Yeah. Richer palette. I, I mean, it's what I expected. I expected the, uh, the store pick to be a little... Mm. Um, just weaker on the palate. Still not bad. Still yeah, not bad. That is interesting. No, no, no. It definitely, uh, other than the colon nut, which I don't always get, it's definitely straddling the line between their normal small batch, which you can get extremely affordably, like 30 bucks, maybe a little more, and the barrel proofs that only come out, the, the, the triune. I'm going to call it a triune. Okay. I don't even know what I mean. Yeah, I don't so, know. something three um, that comes out triune style. So, ooh, see, I get a little velvetiness. <laughs> I get yeah. the velvety in the finish. I'm with picking the, up this velvet right through the mid cheek here with the actual electric grip. With right, the 12 right. Grip. Well, with this, I get that velvety it, finish. It just keeps kind of moving and growing. Again, nothing bad at all. It's definitely straddling the line. So, we'll score it, and then I do want to know the price point. Because that well, would be the trick. I, I didn't write it down. Mm. I've you got it got on a receipt somewhere. You got yeah, it. I mean, they're still uh, scored. Wow, that's still good. It's still phenomenal. It's still really top-notch. Easy. It's an easy 90. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Easy mm. 90 for me. Mm. Uh, this is the, Elijah Craig is the kind of bourbon I like. So, there's my thing. But I still like the small batch, even. I was gonna go eighty-eight. I'll rate. I'll go eighty-nine and say it's just shy. Wait, let me do. Let me do. Let me do you. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. What? It's still not bad. Don't. I, don't think you're getting the the twelve year bottle. Mm -hmm. Wow, the twelve year Elijah Craig Barrel Proof. It's not. It's still good. It's, it's got a good palate. A lot of alcohol. A lot of ABV there. Um, just not the depth that you get from the 12 years. So here's the thing I like about this. I'm not a big, oh, it's X years, so it's X better. I don't I don't buy that. A lot of that comes from my peat background, where the, the older it gets, the less the peat goes. And I'm kind of familiar when the whiskey lock was going on, they started pushing years as some kind of, you know, it's extra aged kind of deal. But if you have the small batch, if you're able to get something that's some kind of private barrel from your local that's eight, nine years, and then do this, you can do this experiment on your own. Small batch, the mid straddle, and the full 12. Mm, mm. Yeah. You'll, you'll, you can tell, because 
You're right. The extra years here have done, or sorry, have done well. And what I like about Elijah Craig is I'm not a big fan when something gets picks up a lot of oak. Theirs don't. At 12 years, I don't get this oak explosion. That would turn me off. Um, yeah, enough. Mm. Um, I want to say it was really, gosh, I want to say they're 70 to $80. Really about the same price. Right? And maybe it depends on the store, um, where you're buying from, how many bottles they ended up getting out of that certain cask. Well, yeah, Christmas on Crestline said he was looking for the Elijah Craig C, this one right here, and somebody wanted 140 for it. He was like, no. That's still not outrageous. That's outrageous. <laughs> yeah, 300 would be outrageous. Out, no. 149 outrageous. is high. Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately. Yeah, well. Not outrageous. It's outrageous. Because <laughs> he found it somewhere else for like... Uh, yeah. If you, yeah, yeah, if you can. If you can right. find it. Hey. So, all right. Go so, to scotchtestdummies.com. You can pick up our merch, shirts, hats. Stuff, burn um, things on it. Yeah. Have our logo. Help support the show. Keeps the lights He's, on. Keeps the whiskey one, coming. One of the hats right there. You can go to Patreon. If you go to Patreon, basically you go to Patreon because you like the show. You want to keep it coming. You can donate as little as a dollar or more per show. That helps us buy these bottles. That's literally what keeps the lights going. Scotch it. You, Scotch Gods. Cilantro. Dummies. Dummies.